Hello guys, this tutorial is going to be how to do a muzzle flare and a blood splatter onto the camera. Here's what I have so far. He's fired one gunshot. What I'm going to do is add another gunshot and the blood splatter. So here's what you want to do. You want to go like right before I get shot. Which is right there. I believe, yeah. It's like right here. Now I have the good shot here. So, you take your footage of a muzzle flare. You can just find these on Google. Then you want to go, you want to toggle switches and modes. Then you want to go to screen. Zoom in so this covers about his face. As you can see, this is way too big. There we go. That's almost perfect. You want to make it about one frame long. You zoom out. See what's See what I got so far. Just gonna go frame by frame. Fires one shot. Fires the other shot. Whoops. It's one shot. Second shot. Yeah, one more about here. Just do the same steps. So there we go. Got our three shots. Now the splatter. Start right about here after the last shot. So you wanna import a picture. You can just go onto Google or just whip out the camera whenever you have a nosebleed. But it's probably safer just to go onto Google. So you want to put it right there. Make it whatever size you choose. You make it fairly large, but right there. Then you want to go into effects and presets. Type in best blur. And you can change the blurriness of how it will look if blood splurred on your camera. Like, I'm going to go about 20, because I think that looks fairly realistic. Make it appear slightly after. Let's see what I got. Forgot to change that. There's the shots, and there's the blood. So yeah, thanks for watching this tutorial. I hope it helped, and I will show you the final result right now.